Okay, another one. Pawn. Against fat kids can't swim. A diamond member from Norway. Let me, let me click something. Let's oh, see. but this is... Uh... This is 15 minutes, no increments. Okay, we're going to get... We're gonna play 2,000 time. bullet, 20, 2,000 blitz, 1830 rapid. Okay. Uh, pawn. Okay. This time we're going to have to play fast. Yes, you have to play a little fast. Oh. oh, we get a chance at redemption. Knight. Uh, okay, yeah, this I've is the Schlechter, Schlechter slot. Right okay. Uh, knight. Okay. I've played this from both sides. This looks like uh It's it's a good, good it's a good line to face. Gotcha. I mean it looks like I mean black has the setup of like a uh, like a Fianchetto Grunfeld except I'm not Fianchetto. It's strange. Kamsky's played this line. Gotcha. Um, let's do See this would be an example. If my pawn wasn't on E3 and it was on E2, I yeah. might play C5. So that I can follow up with bishop f4 and play this uh -huh. as a sort of dark square. You know what I mean? Yeah. And I, I still consider c5 now, but if my bishop was in f4, I'd be a much happier guy. Then I'll play h3, things like that. Here, um, let's go keep things simple, bishop. Hey, JDA, glad to hear. We're on chess.com. I'm uh, probably rooting for Grushuk, uh, Jespi. Uh, okay, I'm thinking about Sa where... Same answer. Um, where now I, let's do... Where I want to put my bishop. Pawn. Okay. So, he says pawn. I feel pretty comfortable putting my bishop on b2. Opposing this bishop. Practically everything is fine. And on e5? e5? Well, yeah, it's not I possible will, here. Uh, yeah, you'll take, take that. that. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. what else? Uh, Bishop f5, you got something for me? Here we can just there, There's flexible options because there's not a ton of tension early yeah. on. I expect, I expect bishop f5. I could also expect knight bd7. Uh, bishop g4. I think I would think about just playing h3 and then the bishop's probably going to relocate to f5. C1 and D1, or D1 and D1? And which one do you move first? Oh. I mean, if I want them on C1 and D1, then, you know, one goes to C1. If I want them D1 and E1, then one goes to E1. Let's see. Uh, C1 and D1. If you're an E4 kind of guy, you probably would have played Bishop D3 in the opening. Instead of Bishop E2? Yeah. Right? That would facilitate E4. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So, but it's because you didn't, yeah. then yeah, you might as well. Yeah. yeah. Trying to also hit 2,400 subs today. Um, let's see. Let's ooh. in a bind. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Well, let's take a look. <laughs> take a look, see? Um, I gotta think about this. I'm gonna I'm gonna do pawn. Okay. We're gonna go for a very simple solution that might not be objectively the maximum, but okay. I want to try something simple and see if he cracks. Okay. Okay. Uh, queen. Let's see. Queen c2 or queen c1. Queen c2. I have to make sure. Like, make sure I find the future is probably some time away. Queen C2. It allows 
have the option of bringing my other rook to c1. Is this something that's important to me? Yeah, I'll play queen c2. On knight f6, I want to play bishop d3. Very, very good. Of course, I mean, yes. this is needed. Bishop d3, uh, the pro yeah. bishop. Very nice. Yeah, you... Yeah. Uh, very important. Okay, move. now let's look at bishop g4. Yes. Definitely a candidate. Very, very good. How do I want have to stop bishop f5? Yeah. How do I want to meet bishop g4? Well, perhaps if I was facing bishop g4, I would move the knight. <laughs> well, uh, okay. I need to be careful because uh, rook c7. There's bishop c6. I believe. Knight. Can't jump in just yet, but maybe I play knight e5 anyway. Really put maybe in the corner. Yeah, we okay, yeah, because But but you're playing natural moves and you're seeing the moves pretty quick and, and it's there's not a lot to calculate the position besides what we're trying to do. No. At least black's not threatening us a lot. Queen. Yeah. The one thing I was just, uh... yeah, no, I think Rook C1 is very natural. I, don't, I shouldn't have taken that long. You're right. You gotta hurry because there's a Fortnite kid for me to spank. What? There's Fortnite kids are in the chat. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> the Fortnite kids are in the chat. They're... That's the fourth. We're being oh, there's attacked. A fifth. There's a fifth. There's it's a fifth. Attack. There's a fifth. <laughs> <laughs> the problem. Well, you want to pre move it? The reason that for the viewers who are just tuning oh, in, they're going to see, they, yeah, yeah. see a weird position. You're right. Unless we're in big time trouble. Yeah, you're right. And now the next one is going to be a challenge for you, John. My move is pawn. Oh, interesting. If you play bishop takes a6, I was gonna go rook a8. Ah. And I get to yeah, yeah, yeah. activate all yeah, of Yeah, that's true. Your next move is pawn, so... But this is not an easy one, what I'm looking for here. Okay. It's not the easiest. All right, what are my candidates? My candidates are a3, so that this threat is alive, a4, so this threat is alive. My candidates are f3 oh. to kick away this knight. And my other candidate is sort of I'm curious, what move did you want? F3 was one, H4 was another. Ah, trying okay. to prepare F3, trying to trap the knight a little bit. It doesn't get trapped, but it gets kicked kicked back and forth. Gotcha. H4 was was the one I was probably going for. Gotcha. And then F3. Let's do pawn. Pawn, okay. I will do. No, what's this knight doing? <laughs> Why, That's right. Why would I? Why kick a knight out, from a, a knight out from a very bad square? That's very correct. Yes. Maybe I just play a3. A3 or a4? It's your choice. Yeah. Thanks, Chesley, for giving us up to Squatchy. But I am quite down the clock, and so, so I need to I need to move with some action. We're gonna make up the fifty seconds. Just prepare some, uh, okay. some like, ideas. Yeah, some ideas. Bring my king to f two. Okay, I mean, how there's some ideas going? right now. Yeah, I mean this. this there is an uh, argument of a four over a three because you still have the threat, but your bishop on b two would have an additional square, which is a three. Gotcha. I see. So I'm actually going to go pawn again. Okay. Okay, a minute 
bit behind, but I will catch up. King f2, bishop a3, these are my candidates right now. If the knight nice. comes to e6, this doesn't concern me. I don't see sort of great prospects yet for the knight. This uh, e5 pawn is surprisingly hard to attack. Let's do king. My move. Yeah. Ah. Hey, we gotta speed up. Pawn. Okay. Uh. <laughs> I got a hard shoulder there. I was like, <laughs> pawn. Well, that's not a pawn. Yeah, 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 I know. I know that's not a pawn. Uh. Yes. That was the move I was looking for. I want to keep the queen side flexible because that's where we're looking to make progress. Yeah. Curb your enthusiasm, dude, with a Twitch Prime. Thank you. Yeah, I just want to lock it we down. We want to lock it yes, down because exactly. the king side is where we want to play. Yep. Okay. Rook. See it, I'm just gonna play a move. Yeah, I'm gonna these two bishops can control this file. Yeah, I shouldn't be concerned about safety of that file. Let's be very aggressive. nice. First up one, that's what we're looking for. The let's bishop on d7 is offside. We have a pass to h1, we have two bishops. Yeah, let's be aggressive. King is on d7, our king is closer to the pawns. That that makes a lot of sense. Yeah. The one thing Eric's been helping me with is like, you know. Aggressive, be, yes. Being more ambitious. Yes. Yes. Yeah. I'm giving him a lot of squares with that move. Oh, your, yeah, yeah, yeah. Five. No, I don't know why I did that. And, um. Yeah, no, you're right. I don't know why I did that. And he's Oh, one sec. There's kids for me to take out. Give me a sec. There's oh. Fortnite kids. They're back. Oh, I put I on know, but I gotta. Oh, let me just get a okay. quick uh, bishop okay. seat. Or tell me. Bishop. Bishop. I put on a five minute delay and the kids are still here. Gotcha. Tommy, would you like to be a mod? Yeah. Bishop. <laughs> Bishop takes g6. Oh lord. Sorry. That's okay. Yep. You're up on time. We still My got apologies. you. We still no no no, it's okay. So, and, and with only two minutes on the clock, we, we can't strive for like just all, all the right moves. Bishop. Pawn. We're still past the H-pawn, rooks on the board, opposite bishops. Doesn't mean a lot yet. Well, I mean... I have to admit, I think one of us is going to flag. This is how the game's going to. But you're play. up a full minute. Yeah, I'm up a full minute, and that's why I'm. And you have a outside. That's why I'm spawn. pleased, but I'm fairly certain one of us is going to flag. Thank you for the gifted subs, Mister. Uh, if Rook check yes. Kings F4, or sorry. well, I can't tell yeah, you. Yeah, Rook. Well, okay, Rook check King. Yeah, yeah. King. Sorry. But then you should be careful. Bishop. And if Rook check King. Why are you going back? Yeah, that's a good point. Pawn. That's a very good point. Bishop? Rook? Time drone, just yeah, yeah. play, but you have safe moves. Yeah, yeah, I have, have safe, safe moves, moves, you're right. Pawn. Just make natural safe moves where it's hard to blunder. Okay. You're up on time, you got. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Rook. Rook. King. 
Next move is going to be King. Bishop. I'm not afraid of marching my king. King. Next move, King. Next move, Pawn. Next move, King. There we go. There we go. King and a pawn. Don't be afraid of marching it down the board. GG. Uh, sure. Pawn. King. We were always ahead. All you were playing very well. Very, very well. I mean, uh, I have to say, still displeased missing sort of bishop g6, and then also sort of going... Well, this was all good, yeah. and this was excellent, and we got a very comfortable position. Yeah. I mean, two bishops, control the c-file. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And here, okay, h4, but f3 is a good move. Like, f3 I can't criticize whatsoever. Here, yeah. a little more precise, probably a4, yeah. threatening this move. Mm -hmm. The reason, guys, John, John didn't do this is because of rook here, and all of a sudden, we just activated black's pieces. We have to move the bishop out of the way, and then he takes here a tempo. No bueno, it's, it's about restrictions, so. Um, f3 is still a good move. Here, a4 could have been played. King f2, the results it leads into similar positions, where let's say, King here, Rook here, could be in very similar to the game, where if this were to happen, yeah. G4 and well, White's a lot better here. Yeah. And Bishop A3, yeah, always a nice option. Mm -hmm. Curb your enthusiasm. Thanks for not only subbing for the first time, but gifting five. But you all played a. Uh, I mean, you got to... It was a low-risk approach. Like, even when you made mistakes, it wasn't even like last game. This game, yeah. you didn't lose material. Yeah, like, there's one move later. Yeah, no, it was good. I thought it was really good. You got a good edge against the position. Like, against that opening. Like, yeah. he didn't take the space. Yeah. And he never really caught up. Yeah. Because this is not, like, a glorious yeah, bishop. Yeah. And this bishop, even though it's not necessarily breaking through here, we managed. We are going to. We can. We're playing on both sides of the board. Mm -hmm. Same can't be said about black. 